in this tutorial i will show how to create bump mapping in autodex maya so take a polygon cube press f to zoom or focus in scale the cube just scale like this go to face selection mode select the this face go to select click inverse press delete to delete the other face modify freeze transformation modify center pivot edit delete by type delete history right click assign new material select lambert now common on common material attribute tabs go down and see here bump mapping just click on this checker box select file now click here file now image name and locate the locate your image file I select this now click open to see the texture on your object just click on this texture icon or press 6 on your keyboard and see this is the bump mapping effect in Maya you can download the image file from the google just search for bump mapping texture again right click assign new material select again lambert this is lambert 3 you can also create bump map in adobe photoshop open your photoshop file new just type 100 by 100 click create sorry this is too small open take this 1280 by 720 Click create. Alt zoom out. Now select your brush tool or pencil tool. Increase the pixel size to about type here 27 now select the color to black and just draw like this just draw like this which design you like you can draw i just introducing you to the basic of the bump mapping in maya now double click and create a new layer put it layer 0 to the above the layer one now go to file save as select jpeg and name it bump map now 
now click save now open your maya lambert 3 again click on the bump mapping checker box select file and locate the file i put it to the desktop now click open and see this is the bump mapping effect in maya it will pull down the black sorry it will extrude in the black area and white area will extrude out see these are white area in bump mapping system the white area will be extrude out and the black area will be extrude in see the black area is extrude in see the effect this is the bump mapping basic in maya you can apply it to any other object just like this now again right click assign new material again select lambert again on bump mapping checker box just click and type here noise and select noise and see this is the noise bump mapping effect you can change the bump value or depth just like this click here you can change the amplitude threshold anything what you like ratio frequency ratio c just like this